Hey Dragon Slayers! Today's video is Dr. Fung's Low Carb Recipes Grain Free Pancakes. Don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps the channel out. Let's get started. The prep time is 10 minutes, the cook time is 30 minutes. It yields four to six pancakes, which are about two servings on average. So for the ingredients, you're going to have two eggs, a half cup of heavy whipping cream, that's at least 35% fat, plus more for topping, which is optional. One teaspoon of pure vanilla extract, half a tablespoon of organic honey or erythritol, or you'll have one fourth cup of Oh yeah, so honey or erythritol. And then you'll have one fourth cup of coconut flour, one half teaspoon of baking soda, one fourth teaspoon of Himalayan salt, one tablespoon of butter or coconut oil, plus more for topping, which is also optional. Ground cinnamon for topping, again, optional. So the directions, you're going to preheat a skillet or griddle over medium heat. In a small bowl, combine the eggs, cream, vanilla, and honey. In a separate medium-sized bowl, combine the coconut flour, baking soda, and salt. Slowly stir the wet ingredients into the dry ingredients. Melt the butter in the skillet. Pour in two to three tablespoons of batter to form the pancakes, about three inches in diameter. Cook for two to three minutes on each side until golden brown. Repeat with the remaining batter. Top the pancakes with whipped cream, butter, and cinnamon if desired. This could not be any easier. So it's super, super simple. Um, if you like pancakes, I think this is a great keto-fied way to do it. Um, I did this really dumb thing in college where IHOP had all-you-can-eat pancakes, and if you ate 26 of them, you got your entire table's food for free. So me being a poor college kid, it was me and like seven of my friends. And the eight of us, I had gotten to, I want to say 16 pancakes and I was done. And they egged me on because the bill would have been like 400 and some dollars. They're like, come on, dude, you can do it. And I trudged through. It took me over four hours, but I did it. I did not eat a pancake again for 10 years. <laughs> like It was a horrible decision. Don't be me. Um, but this recipe is pretty solid. I think it's very tasty. Uh, adding in the vanilla flavor just makes it so much better. And fresh whipped cream is incredible. So that's what I've got for you guys today. Don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps the channel out. And remember, guys, that together, you and I will slay the dreaded diabetes dragon.